as it was written, I am the Alpha, the Omega, the truth, and the light. My father once believed, if the world found out what I could really do, they would reject me. He was convinced that the people wasn't ready. What do you think? You running for you, little bitch? Come on, bro. Shit, I, shit. I, I'm, I'm not running. I, I ain't do shit, man. I don't, I don't got y'all stash. What you thought you was just come to New York, take our stash, and run back home to Philly? Bro, I wasn't trying to escape. I ain't do that shit, What's bro. I gotta take one for the team. And come tonight on. is you. Stop crying like a little bitch and take it like a man. Fuck. Right. Come on, what the fuck you make? Man, come stop on, crying bro. like a little no. bitch. Fuck. What about him? I'm catch his ass later. Thanks, man, for allowing me to stay in one of your furnished apartments, man. No problem, man. No problem. Listen, I want you to know I'm real sorry about what happened with Dre. Yeah. Right? I've been waiting for you. Now, here's the key to your new place. Mm -hmm. Experience your new life. It's apartment 3B. You gotta take the stairs. The elevator's broke. Okay. And I'll be uh, checking with you later. I got an okay. issue in another, another property of mine. All right. Who was that? Come on, man, you know. Man, I told you I like to do things by myself. I didn't do all that taking orders and different stuff like that. Look, man, I, they're getting money, man. Yeah, I'm getting money too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Take about bringing this shit in my, my house, man. I'm not a little boy. Man, you can't tell me, Jack. You ain't my father. I don't have to listen to nothing you say. I ain't trying to be your father. I'm your big brother. Don't disrespect Mama House. Yo, I'm sick of you, Cody. I keep telling you, you're not my father. We can shoot the one. I'm a grown man. We're telling Dre. Sit your ass down, man. Y'all better not be in here fighting again. I am sick and tired of y'all fighting and arguing. You're brothers. You're supposed to love each other. Come on. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm not a little boy. I'm a grown man. Seriously. So what you trying to say? I'm trying to say we can shoot the one. I'm gonna sign the back. 
You coming? No, 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 stop. Listen, I need y'all to stop fighting. I can't take this anymore. Well, you need a lesson. You need a lesson. I need y'all to get along. Man, just, he ain't listen, nobody. you gotta take care of each other. No, no. Stop! Stop! I'll break your better than this. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop! I taught y'all better than this. Stop! Oh, man. man, you ain't nobody, man. You used to be somebody with that karate garbage move. But now you ain't nothing but washed up. Don't hate on me, bro. Man, move! Chill, chill, chill. <laughs> Oh. Stop! I told you to stop it! That's your little brother, you're supposed to protect him! You're the man of this house! Sorry. Sorry, nothing! Hey, B. Hmm. How far is South Street from here? Go down here, make a right. Come on, let me show you, let me show you. You go down there and you make a right. Go about 10 blocks. And you, what you looking for? Santana Warehouse shipping. <sighs> yeah, they always hiring. And I know the owner. All I gotta do is make a phone call. Nah, nah, man, I told you on the phone. You know, I'm gonna do this on my own, man. All right, I can respect that. You got my number. If you need anything, just call me. That's another thing. Since I've been back, I tossed my phone. Start fresh, man. No phone? Man, you really you really grinding from the beginning, huh? Yeah. Cody, look, I, I respect all of that, but get yourself a phone. Okay. And remember, blood don't make people family. Loyalty doesn't. You've always been loyal to me, so we always going to be family. You got that? I appreciate that. Well, let me get down here. I got a 3 o'clock appointment. Hey, good luck. Yes, how you doing? I have an appointment with Mr. Santana. Just fill out the top portion and sign right by the X. Cody, right? Yes. Come with me, please. Sure. You know, smile. Sometimes. Yes, thank you for coming. Thank you. The three o'clock is here. Please sit down. Let's not waste any time. Why do you want to work here? Um, sir, I'm strong. I can do the work, and I need a job. Okay. Be here Monday at 6 a.m. Really? Yeah, just be on time. One more thing, uh, Cody. No funny business with my daughter. Who's your daughter? The woman who walked you in here. Oh. Uh... Oh, yeah, I saw the way you looked at her. You know, when I say no funny business, I mean no funny business. Mr. Santana, I heard you loud and clear. Thank you for the opportunity. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yo, I heard you've been putting in work and holding things down. I'm looking to expand. And for that, 
I'm gonna need a right hand man. Think you up for the challenge? And the Wu Tang sauce. Hey, what you say is true. Yeah, I'm built for this. It's time to take that walk. Walk the warrior. You win. Don't disappoint me. Yeah, man. I got a bad feeling about this. I, w I wanted to buy and develop over here. Look how far I had to park. This neighborhood just don't feel right. It's not that bad since I left. <laughs> really, Cody? Look, did you get the job? Of course. I guess that phone call I made to Santana didn't have nothing to do with it. <laughs> but I told you not to make that call, man. My bad, Cody. I just want you to be successful now that you're back in the great city of Newark. But um, as a reward, let's go grab a bite to eat my treat. Oh, cool. I ain't gonna never turn out no food. Yeah. But listen, man, let me handle my business, man. Wait a second. I gotta, uh, I gotta talk to somebody over here. Yo, y'all, um, you seen your big homie? Nah, wow, what's up? Looking for him for a couple of days now, but can't get through on his telephone. You know how he get down. We're gonna tell him you came through, though. Good looking out. Hey, yo, hey, yo, B, hold up, man. Let me hold a couple of dollars, man. You the money man, right? Nah, not me. That's your man. But I, I got you on the next go round. It's on the next go around. Hey, yo, who's this right here with his chest poking out like that, man? Hurry right up, man. Yo, man. Are we bringing no new blood around here with some time to discuss business? You feel me? Oh, wait, wait, wait. This, this, this is my man, and he ain't got nothing to do with what we doing. What's up, homes? You good, man? He good. He's good. He's good. You better fix his face. Come on, come on. Hey, I'm sorry about that, man. I've just been trying to catch up with this guy for two days, and I, I can't, can't find him. No, that's okay, man. So what's up? You still got some fight in you? Nah, man, I hung that up a long time ago. You sure? Now, you, you used to be real good with your hands and feet. Every Saturday afternoon, they have this underground fight. And they play big, brother. Nah, I ain't interested. You sure? Now look, the dojo's right up the block. Let's go check it out real quick. You wanna go inside? Nah, I'm good from right here. You looking hard like you wanna jump in. Nah, that's my pass. Well look, tomorrow's Saturday. And I don't miss those fights because it's an easy way to turn a couple of hundred into a couple of thousand. And that's where we gonna be. Let's go get a drink. Yo, I'm telling you, man, you're throwing money around right here. This is the Hood Fights, Brick City, New Jersey, man. Y'all come on down here, you saying, and get your ass whooped, man. Yeah, come on down to Big City and get that ass whoop, you understand what I'm saying? That's what they do down here, right? Yo, man, what the fuck? Don't make me bust you. Nah, money, I ain't got no problem with you. Go ahead, bro. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that.
I ain't even looking at you. You see that? <laughs> yep, this is the spot, baby. New arc. Just like I pictured it. Nar. Yeah. It's been a long day, man. Been with you all day. Where we going, man? Hey, yeah, you safe, you safe. One of my shorties works here, man. Come on, I want you to meet her. She's nice. I didn't know you was coming. Who's your friend? Oh, this is my man Cody from back in the day. He just came back in the area. We've been kicking and catching up with each other. And I want to come by and see my favorite girl. Damn. <laughs> Relax, you home. Are we going to order? She, she already know. You guys go enjoy. See what I said. Is that your girl or something? Something, something like that. So what have you been up to since I moved away? Well, let's see, uh, women and more women. <laughs> no, and I just been doing my real estate thing, buying up everything I can get my hands on. That place you staying in now, that was my last investment. I got that for a steal. <laughs> well, you could use some of that money to fix up the elevator. <laughs> okay, you got it, you got it. <laughs> You know her? Yeah. That is uh, Santana's daughter, Kimberly. Leave her alone, man. She is bad news. Man, her father gave me that lecture earlier. Leave my daughter alone. You should take his advice and leave his daughter alone. To us. To what? To us. To me. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Hey, bartender, Samad. I need a cocktail. <laughs> no homo. Can we help you with something, Samad? Shut up, man. You don't try to see him on him drink? Wait, wait, wait. How did we even get in here? Aren't you like 12? Oh, word. <laughs> How you get in here? And besides, stop playing yourself, girl. You know you want this. Come on, man. Uh, hey, Bernard. Nobody Where's that bathroom at? Whatever your name is. What's this over there? Bartender, I need a drink. All right, I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. Ew, Samad, that is so nasty. Don't fall in. Come on, go ahead. We'll take y'all down. Ladies, ladies. Is everything okay? Yeah, everything yes. Everything good, bro? We good. You standing right. behind me. That's a little... All right. Continue enjoying your evening. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, bruh, you still worried about them ladies is all right, huh? Get out of here! No problem, no Look, man, we don't want no problems. This is just a misunderstanding, man. You ain't got nothing to do with this. What? Get the hell out! Come on, dude. Let's get out of here, Cody. Come on. Damn it! Hey, hey, hey! I need to come on, come, come on, come on, me. Come on.
as you can see, I don't got much here. Just moved in. That's okay. Don't worry about that. Yeah, tonight was crazy, right? Oh my gosh, yes. I can't believe that even just happened. Thank you for rescuing me, though. Hey, Kimba. I'm gonna bring you. I'm gonna bring you back here for this. I didn't say you did, but I want you. I've been digging you ever since you came in the office today. So you want this? Yes. your father warned me to stay away from you earlier today. Are you serious? My father gives all the guys the same speech. Stay away from my little girl. <laughs> <laughs> like nobody's good enough for me. Hmm. So, why'd you move back to Newark? <sighs> Just came here a couple of days ago. When I was staying in Philly with my family, my younger brother, I caught out there with some gang stuff. Turned up missing. And dead. Wow, I'm sorry to hear that. It's okay. The only lead the cops had was some guy with a scorpion tattoo on his arm. Please get me. I got them. Fine. My father has stage five cancer. We're only giving him six months to live. He's refusing treatment. He says he just wants to die when he dies. I lost my mother when I was two years old, so I go home at night because I don't want him to be alone. Wow. The handle is so strong. I don't feel strong all the time, but I have to be. On Friday, I'm having a party for my birthday. I want you to come if you're not too busy. Not the party in tight, but I'll come to support. <laughs> Thank you. Well, look, my Uber be here in five minutes, so I gotta get dressed. All right. Oh, yo, cowboy, get that. What up, Jay? You're late. Who you talking to, Turtle? Don't get embarrassed in front of your little girlfriend or your partner. Time is money, Jay. You're about your money. You should be able to respect that. Well, give it to me then. Since time is money. Yo, be careful with that, all right? Just take one. They don't call it the last dragon for nothing. Exactly. Because all these little smart comments, these are in the house. Yo, hold up. What you say? Nothing. Baby, you hungry? Yeah. What you want? I'm not eating no fast food. Nobody said nothing about no fast food. You hey, you yes. hungry? Yes, I'm starving. Oh, I'm hungry too. Ah! All right, I'm ready. Let's go. 
Yeah, man. You gotta take them things every time you fight. Shut up and stop asking so many questions. Hey, I'm just saying, you can't win a fight without it. I don't need shit to win a fight. I take it because it guarantees I win every fight. What's that dude name? A Toro? A Toro what? Why are y'all hyping? What's the fuck going? Steroids or something? Muscle juice? Muscle milk? Yo, I need you to go see Lefty, get that money for me, all right? All right, cool. He'll be back. Yeah. Bernard, my guy, what's up, man? Where you going so fast? You know you lost again, right? So how you going to pay me, I'll baby? I'll be my Big, man. Big, small bills, what's up? Talk all right. to me. Uh, you know, my, my, my dude was cheated, right? But, but, but a bet is a bet. So you got that. Let me run down to my car. I'm going to get that for you, man. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Ah, you ain't going to hit me with the okie doke, man. Come on, I'll walk with you. Let's go. What, man? Look, Poppy, Jay's fighting next. Double or nothing. Are you serious? <laughs> Listen, man, you think I'm gonna place my bets against Jay? Is you serious? Come on, man, you know better than that. Look, Poppy, I'm a little light, all right? So, so how about I hit you off next week? You know what, Bernard? I like you, but I don't like you that much. But you know what? I'll let you slide, man. Next week, man, I want my money, brother. With right. interest. Say that. It was packed up in there, man. I told you they get a good turnout. Man, I can see. I gotta uh, find my man. That last fight, I bet big on him. He gonna pay up. Yeah, all right. Yeah, I'm saying they were going to do it from last night, see? Where? Yeah, man. What's up with you? Hey, man. H how's it going? I've been looking for you for a few days. I, I, couldn't, I couldn't get you. You know how to reach me if you need me. Man, forget all that, Jay. Let's get to this situation right here. That's right, because my man ain't no punk. This him? Yeah, that's him. Dude from the bar last night. Yeah, that's Mr. Tuck guy. If it isn't Cody. Jay? Wait, hold on, man. You, you know him? Yeah, I know him. Oh, boy. Is it little old Cody from the block? You used to be Chief's favorite black belt winning all the titles. We couldn't get shit when you was on. But that was a long time ago. It's a new day. Think you about to come back around for a takeover? I'm going to see about that. You was on that tough shit last night. Get hey, hey, let's talk about this before it gets any uglier. You uh. lucky uh. this time. It's my ring now. You ain't from around here no Come more. on, Jay. Don't let me see you. Come, Come on, Cody. Come on, we gotta get out of here. Come on, bro. We got my man Jay, y'all know what he do. He's a killer, killer instinct, coming in here. He's about to be crazy, and he's going against Majesty. I wonder if he gonna be able to hold up towards your Majesty.
well, y'all. Y'all see it gets real here. I don't think it's gonna be another fight for your majesty. I think his majesty is done. But uh, Jay is in the building doing what he does, y'all. I want you to challenge Jay to a rematch, and I want you to win. No. No, Chief. I won't. After today, I'm done fighting. I quit. Cody. Cody. Cody, get back here. Cody. Excuse me, excuse me. Hi, how can I help you today? Yes, I'm sorry. I'm here to see the chief. May I ask who it is? Old friend. Okay, well, he's in a class right now, so if you don't mind just waiting for a second. All right, thank you. You're welcome. been a while. I heard what happened to your brother Dre. Yeah, things happen. I know you loved your brother very dearly. You can't control his lifestyle. It's draining you. You look washed up. <laughs> I'm far from washed up. I see you still wearing a medallion from years ago. I know you didn't come here to talk about my medallion. Talk to me. What's wrong? Yesterday, I had a run-in with Jay. It wasn't a pleasant one. We had a fight and I let him get the best of me. But that fight reminded me of something. All them titles, all them fights. I used to fight with my heart, not with my body. Cody, really pains me to see what you and Jay have become. When you came to me as boys, you were more like brothers. But you were able to catch on to techniques quicker than him. He began to envy you. 
when you defeated him in every single battle, he began to hate you. He's a good fighter, but you, you're a better fighter. He never learned the art of moving the way that you did. That's what helps you win and makes him lose. But Chief, it wasn't supposed to come to this. Follow me. Hit me. What? Come on, hit me. Nah, Chief. Got too much respect for you for that. Respect will get you killed. Now hit me. What you hit me for? Think. Feel it. Try again. Hey, Cody, what's up? How you doing? I'm good. I like that color on you. Oh, thank you. OK. <laughs> I didn't expect you to see you today, Cody. Chief, I had a long day at work. I got caught looking at the boss's daughter when I was instructed not to. Well, did you mess with her? <sighs> it just happened. It is a sign of a master who can control his little head by using his big head. It is a sign of a fool who allows his little head to control his big head. You're out of discipline. You are lacking focus. I need you to concentrate. I want you to start training every day from this point on. Chief, I will be here every day. Let us begin. Day one. Cody. Cody! Oh. Uh, everything okay here? Everything's okay. Good, good. So, I want to tell you, for your first week, I'm very impressed with you. I'm really impressed with your uh, work ethic. Thank you, I appreciate that. Man. Now, look, I know it's Friday and I hate to ask, but I need you to stay late. Mike is running late and I don't have anyone else to cover. It's not a problem. It's not a problem. Uh, appreciate it. You sure you don't need anything else? I'm okay. Very well then.
ain't gotta love me. Love me, love me. you ain't gotta love me. Love me, love me. You keep on thinking that you the only girl in this world. No, you ain't gotta love me. No, not anymore. I could get love from anybody, so girl, just hit the door. It's not you, hey. but girl, you had me going crazy. Hey, you made it. I texted you. Yeah, I was already here already. Happy birthday. I want this for the world. How sweet. You didn't have to. Dance with me, Cody. We started just kicking it as friends way back when, way back when. I was feeling you, you was feeling me, but we let it be. Really, we ain't had no choice, yeah, you was doing you. Yo, check out Jay's girl. Yeah, that's me. Can't it a little too close if you ask me. Yeah, hold on, man. I'm about to call Jay right now. Yeah, I'm call. call him up. Got me feeling all squeezing in my knees. I think you could just shot me. How could this happen? Tell myself you were just an attraction. Now look, I can't get enough. Keep it perfect like a ball. You, you change me. Shorty, you change me. If I knew back then, would've made you my baby. Would've made you my lady. Forget the past, cause my ass know I'm not acting shady. And girl, I'm just saying. You change me. You change me. Ooh, you change me. You change me. Shorty, you change me. If I knew back then, Happy birthday, love. What are you doing here? What am I doing here? What you mean? I didn't stutter. You know I wouldn't miss my queen's birthday for the world. Get off of me. Your queen. I didn't invite you. How did you even get by security? I have a guest list. Got the juice card. Now relax. I won't start no trouble. I'm just here to celebrate with you just like everybody else. You're right. Come on, Didn't I tell you don't let me see you again? Jay, just take the place right now. What are you doing? Man, what are you even doing here? With my girl at that? How do you even know my girl? What do you mean your girl? I work with your girl. And your girl invited me. My girl must have bumped her head. She made a mistake. So I'm uninviting you, chump. But no, what are you doing? You work for me, man. I'm just just trying to straighten things out, man. We it's just a misunderstanding. Let's go, Cody. Yo, this is my shit. My town, my girl, my world. A word, Jay? Your girl? Yo, I'm out. Get out of here. Nobody care about you anyway. You can keep your girl. I don't want no problems. Somebody that don't want no problems, you stay asking for it. Come on, man. Man, he won't even fight for his respect. You weak! Man, go ahead, Cody! Chop. Get out of here. Yo, DJ, oh, turn the music back up. So, I mean, what does we got coming in today? Well, we yeah, have two on the hour and one at four o'clock. Look, I might need you to cover for me later on tonight. We gotta talk. About what? About last night. Give me a minute. Okay. Listen, I need you to know I didn't set you up to look bad last night. It's okay. You don't mind him. I'm done with it. But how do you know him? It's in the past. It is what it is. Look, we know we're not supposed to be talking like this at work. Okay, fine. But you need to know that Jay has a lot of power. More than you know. Yeah, well, you should. You need to check it over, you know? I hope I didn't scare you. <laughs> no, no, not at all. Get out. <clears throat> so, uh, to what do all of this pleasant visit? Pleasant visit? <laughs> Santana, Santana, Santana. I thought we had a deal. I will cover your monthly expenses and take you out of debt. And in return, you will give me room to handle my business. And you will keep your little workers away from Kimberly. Well, yeah, I'm with you. I, I, I don't understand the problem. The problem? 
problem is, I just got word this morning that my packages arrived tampered with. And last night I had a little run-in with your worker Cody at Kimberly's party. Cody? Yeah, the new guy that works for you. Yes, yes. You know exactly who he is. Him and Kimberly were real close on the dance floor the other night. Too close. So I had to intervene. I, I, I didn't know they had anything going on. Sweet. Well, now you know. Mr. Santana? Not now. Go! Go! Call it to the office. Don't make me come back in here. Yes, come in. Have a seat. Cody, last night when you were here, did you notice anything wrong with the boxes that you were handling? Yeah, one of the, the boxes was damaged. Damaged? What do you mean damaged? I mean, when I was shifting and moving around, one of the boxes fell and some white stuff came out of it. I'm sorry, Mr. Santana, I was going to tell you. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's... All right, these things happen. Don't worry about it. Oh, one more thing. Did you... Happened to go to uh, Kimberly's party last night. Yes, I was invited. Did you um, happen to have words with a young man named Jay? Yeah, Jay was there. Cody, did I not make it clear when you took this job that you were to stay away from Kimberly? Yes, you did. Where's all these questions coming to, though? I hate to do this, but I, I have to let you go. Let me go. Yes. Mr. Santana, I need this job. I'm just getting settled. No, 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 I hear you. But you become a liability. And I I can't afford to piss off my investor. Your investors? Fool! Thought you was innocent. You just covering up that stuff Jay sell. What, Kimberly? What happened? What you mean, what happened? Why are you leaving? What happened? Your boyfriend, Jay, just got me fired. Oh, Cody, I told you he's not my boyfriend. <laughs> Come on, it's kind of funny he's in there talking to your father, and then I just get fired? Wait a minute. Let me go find out what's going on. Kimberly, do me a favor. Just leave me alone. come here to train. So what do you want? I heard you've been training Cody. What if I am? That's gonna stop today. Yeah, man, that's gonna stop today. Turtle, what are you doing here? No chief, no disrespect. This is just about money. If you guys do not leave, I will call the police. No, you're gonna stop training. You're gonna stop training them or else. Or else what? Well, Stitch. Oh, come on, man! Ah! Shame! Shame! 
shut her. I got this. I got it. I need to get through. Back up! Through. Back oh up! My God. Oh, Cody, it's you. Hi, Cody. How are you? Come on in. Can I get you something to drink? Are you hungry? You thirsty? No, I'm okay, Ms. Brown. Thank you. Thanks for coming again, Cody. Um, anything you need? Oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. Thank you. Thank you. Look, I can't stay that long, but I know you wanted to talk to me. I did, but all right, you know what? Just hold on a moment. I have something for you. Cody, this belonged to the chief's father. And now that he's gone, I'm sure he would love for you to have it. Thank you, but I can't accept this. You can, and you will. Have you ever wondered why, as a kid, your mother never had to pay for you to take classes? Well, I was just good. <laughs> Ain't nobody that good, Cody. My husband and your mother had an affair, and the end result was you. What? Cody, Chief was your father. But we come from a time where we just covered things up and put the bones in the closet. Now listen, I want you to keep that chain. It belonged to your father, and I want you to wear it. Thank you, Ms. Brown, for sharing that with me. You're welcome, Cody. Thanks again for coming. Now listen, I want you to go on and make your father proud. You hear me? Make your father proud. Boy, I got 50 bands riding on this, boy. 
You already know you gotta make it happen for us, boy. You gotta eat, you know what I'm saying? He's nothing. Lewis, you already know what we came here to do. We came here to eat, get this money, and we going home. All right? You already know what it is. We here. We been through the struggle. We here. Let me say break him up, fam. You know he can't stop you. Rocky Balboa, you feel it's over. No regrets. You feel me? you did the old boy earlier that was crazy man he didn't even stand a chance when it does feel good but it's getting way too easy mm. it's because you ain't have no real opponent <laughs> this guy you again yo jay let me handle this light work get him baby he don't want that problem cody you ain't built like that you got lucky with them in the bar the other night but this time it ain't going down like that look me and you know what happened to the chief. Yeah, tough break. Who cares about the chief? So you can't keep your flunkies quiet. But look, what about me and you? You ain't built like that. I can't even do it to you. You scared? Never. Hold on, man. I know you're not going to let him just rock with that. Not at all. You know you ain't ready for this. But one month from today, you gonna meet your final resting place. <laughs> I'd be ready. What is this place here, man? You wanna get back in the game, we gotta get your feet wet. I told my man Struggle to check you out and see what kind of work you need. Who, Struggle the trainer? Yeah, that's my man. He say you ready, then you ready, come on.
good, baby. Man, y'all doing it like this up in here? <laughs> you sure about this, man? Let me know what you think. You got somebody for him? Yeah, I got somebody for him. Okay. Let's Clear the spot out, man. Give me a minute. All right. You gonna do your thing. Who are you? Need there, man. Some I should push on. Sure, sure. Tell me you was bringing me here to fight, man. Can we stretch some more for this? I don't care how much you stretch, you still would've got your ass whooped. But you see I earned his respect though, right? Yeah, you did. But it was still after you got your ass whooped. Man, he was breaking you down like you was pop locking. Person? I got the right person. Poppy sends his regards. Oh, Poppy? You got the money? If not, I got a person. Leg or arm? Your choice. Leg or arm? Man, tell Poppy. Y'all, it's your boy Jay Black, man, and we right back here for the Underground Showdown. You know who we got today? We got your man Candy Man. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, it's going down, man. The big white boy is back and he got snacks in his back pocket. <laughs> ah, yeah. Candy, First up, we got my man Cody. Now this dude is a newcomer. We ain't seen nothing from him before, but we gonna see what he got today up against the candy man. So I think we need yeah. to get this thing started. What y'all think? Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 All right, y'all stay tuned. I'll be right back at you. Jay Black, yeah. Black. Do what you do. Now you got that big old polar bear over there. I want you to go there and I want you to knock his ass out. And that way we get paid. 
And when we get paid, we have money to do what we do. Sweet security, man. Yo, the police! The police! Cody, come on, get up. You all right? Get, get out of here. Police come. Come on, come on. Cody! This isn't over. We got more fight to finish. Cody, I know you ain't thinking about this. Come on, man. The cops is coming. We got to get out. Okay, you go and play with that bitch. Polar bear if you want to. I'm going to I'm be starting the car up, baby. Come on. Nothing. Come on. Yo, what up, Jay? Yo, we just got back from North Carolina here that business you want to handle. But yo, I heard this dude Cody talk mad crazy. I, we want to fight you and all that. Trev, can't be serious. Thinking I'm thinking about Cody. You ain't got to think about him at all. Because we can make him disappear just like his punk little brother Drake. Just nah. give us the word. I'm going to beat Cody just like I did when we was younger. Then I remember who the head honcho was. And always will be. I feel more comfortable if he was sleeping in his grave, man. Word. Because he looked like the type that got the cops on speed down. I, I know you're going to do him dirty. Right. This is what we're going to do. I'm going to dust him off in the ring first. After that, I can put him in that black bag. Then his mother could shop for a new black dress. She just recite the one she wore at Drake funeral. <laughs> and his mom's got a fat ass, too. <laughs> Yo, me and Trev, we was at the funeral. It was like a movie. Crying and acting like we was caring about him and all of that. <laughs> all right, man, we out of here, man. Oh! Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Think about that. Think about that the next time you want to run around here with them little girls. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, yeah. Think you, about that one. Are you hungry? Yeah, I'm hungry. You know I'm hungry. All right. Woo, me too. Let's go get something to eat. Let me get my jacket. Mm. Mm. Nah, it's not. Hold on. I think you owe me something. Hey, Jay, I've been trying to get in touch with you, but, uh, you know, I've been, things have been a little slow. Listen, I'm acting like you wasn't a part of that incident the other night. Yeah, and I didn't even know you knew Cody like that, man. But no, you know damn well I know Cody. My only concern is the money that you owe me for letting you buy real estate on my blocks. Yeah. That's all. I think things been slow, man. Do I look like I care? Relax, sweetheart. Nothing's gonna happen to that pretty little face. Yeah. And I wish you would. She's faithful. How sweet. Just give me a few days and I'll get that to you. Yeah, I know you will. I know you will. I see your tired ass later. You all right? You look like you're getting ready for war. Hey, relax, partner. It's just me. Don't be creeping up on me like that. Bernard, where you been? I just, just been laying low, taking some time out for me. I heard you fighting Jay soon. Yeah, I have to. He ain't the kind to let stuff go. He's going to get what's coming to him. I can't tell you what it's like working, breaking your back every day. It is to have someone extort you for everything you worth. It ain't no way to live. Bernard, is there something you're not telling me? I hope you kill him in that ring. Because if you don't, somebody else will. 
Yeah. Oh, what's up, my bro? Stan. What's happening? What's going on, man? When you get back? Well, I've been back for a minute now. Okay. What you doing out here, though? What's up, though? Oh, man, that's where I be at, man. I'm just doing me. Everybody ain't have it like you naturally when we grew up, you know what I mean? Pardon me, Bernard. It's my man Stan. Stan is oh, my what's man up, Bernard. Man? Hey, baby. How you? Good, good. Okay. Yeah, they used to call Stan my shadow back in the day. He all grown up. Mm. I'm saying, you looking all slim. What's going on? Oh, man, I'm just out here trying to do my thing, man. You know, I still hit hard, though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But hey, man, this is my man Problem. Doing this in yeah, street. he don't really speak much, but you know, he a problem out here in the streets when we do this train thing. Listen, I'm going to leave you out to that working out and train and stuff, but uh, Cody, I'm going to give it you later. I'll give you a call. All right. You ain't trying to train pops? <laughs> I'm a lover, not a fighter, baby. <laughs> so you look like you out here for something. I am. Going to fight Jay. Oh, man, that's wild crazy, man, all them years? He still trying to get you for the type? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, man, well, me and Problem could train you, man. You look like you out of practice. You always been a funny dude, but I can use the motivation. Oh, well, let's get it then, man. I want to see you knock Jay down anyway, man. So let's get to it. All right, cool. I'll see you at the gym. What's up, man? Look, man, you ready for tomorrow? Tomorrow's your big day. But I think my homework on Jay, man. I know you want to win. Everybody wants you to win. You sure about everybody? Come on, listen, man. You didn't think Jay was going to naturally be nice, did you? I heard about what he's doing. Hey, man, I'm just telling you, we can sit there and think about what you're stepping into. I need you to be ready, man. So now you want me to fight dirty? No, nah, I'm not saying that. I think about it, man. Right, because I'm saying, man, what's the problem? I'm saying I just need some time to think, man. Dang, you trying to win, right? Of course I'm trying to win. So think about what? Look, man, nobody's going to know about this but just us. All right. Oh, man, what's to think about? So the what to all this pleasant surprise? Everything's good with me. Me too. Yeah, me too. Everything good with you? Okay. Mm-hmm. Look at you, Cody. Nice to have you back in town. Heard you've been putting in work. Remember me? Yeah, I remember you. you. Used to be playing with them weird animals back in the day. Messing with that science stuff. That's right. As you can see, not a whole lot has changed. This is my man, Hellboy. What's up, fellas? So I know you know about the fight with Kobe and Jay, right? It's coming up. I mean, I've heard a thing or two, but you know, I don't get out much. So I think my man, Kobe, need a little extra help. Come on now, Stan. You know, that's a conflict of interest. Jay is my number one client. I'm getting out of here, man. Nah, hold up, hold up. They can't shut us up. <laughs> well, I'm a businessman, but I do remember how you used to look out for me in the playground. The kids would try to bully me. So, I got something for you. Here you go. There's a bottle on the house. So this has got the streets all messed up. We didn't create it for Jay to produce. We created it for good. If that's so, why are you still producing them? Look, somebody need to talk to Jay. How about that? Look, Jay going down tonight. So make sure this is your last batch. Hey, 
whatever will get Jay off my back is cool with me. We be talking. Yeah, you know. Yeah, I see it right there. That's why I'm trying to stroll through it. Be done in a little bit. When? Only if that happens. Cool. Cause you already know we put that together. So when we make. You always have been disloyal. Yo, all right, let's talk to the money man. man. I'm 20k for the cut right here. All right, cool. Give me some. Give me right. some my man right, right. here. Man. Right. All right, cool. I want to get paid. All right, that's what it's it all is. Works. Man. Everybody taking more bets right now, baby. Right here. What's up? That's it. Man. Hey, y'all broke. When you came in this month, you know you ran the tournament. <laughs> Whoop the tournament on your ass. <laughs> well, well, well. If it ain't Trey Big Brother Cody. What? What you say about my brother? Yo, relax, man. Me and Dre go way back, man. So shame what happened to him. I see you balling up your fist. That won't be a good look, fam. Because we ain't the fighting type. So what type are you? The click clack type. Because I ain't scared. Well, that's good, because we don't want you to be scared. We want you to be aware. Because after Jay beats you down tomorrow, you got one option. Leave. And if I don't? Yo, listen here, you fake-ass Bruce Leroy. We ain't asking you, we telling you. And if you don't, then you'll see tomorrow. Again, I ain't scared. I'm the fearless one. Yo, you gonna get this work today, man. Wait, hold, hold, up, hold up, hold up, hold up, son. Hold up, hold up, son. This is let Jay whip his ass tomorrow. Then after that, you be sleeping with your brother. Come on, man, let's go, man. Tomorrow, man, tomorrow! Feel me, sweetheart? <laughs> oh, my money, man. Poppy, come on now. How far we go back? Come on, man, you know, I don't want to hear you. that. We go back like rocking chairs, baby. I got you. Listen, you know what? Tired of you, man. I got you, man. Nah. Whoa. Not chill. Not here. Oh, you, oh, Come oh, on, oh. man. Oh, it's no, some... See your ass outside, man. Come on, man. It's oh, like that. Okay. All right. I see you. Let me see you first. Listen, I know I'm the last person you want to talk to right now, but I just need to tell you now, Cody, but please hear me out. Kelvin, what is it that you have to say to me? I need to explain the other day when I was with Jay. Listen, I was only with him because he threatened to kill me and my father. I love you. I want to be with you. Kimberly, I'm going to prepare for a fight. We can talk about this later. Okay. But listen, Cody, I need you to win this for us.
fresh out the gate, new come on the scene, my man Cody. What's Cody's uh, alias? What's his name, Cody what? Just straight Cody? I think he's a Viper. Cody Viper? That's his name? Or, or, is, he, or is he a Vandal? Man, bro, you smell like trees. <laughs> Man, they found Stan dead behind my shop. Now the cops are saying that it was a robbery. Now me and you both know that wasn't no damn robbery. Jay's going down tonight. 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 You gonna do this? You see the car, y'all? I mean, is that is that real? Is it injections? Is it silicone? Nah, she got cellulite, brother. That shit is real. <laughs> oh my goodness. Damn, the focus is that backside. Make your ass clap.
Cody, I told you Jay don't fight fair, man. He ain't clean on that stuff. Cody, don't fight fair. He, Cody, he on that stuff, man. Oh, I need to get ready to stop. All right, easy. You good? live at the Essex County Courthouse awaiting the arrival of the defendant Julio Santana who we just heard was cleared on all counts in this high-profile murder case that we broke the story on back in September. We here at News 100. Here they are now. Mrs. Santana. Hey, Kathy, the only thing my client is interested in doing is going home for some much needed rest and relaxation. This has been a trying ordeal for him. That the judge ruling was the absolute right thing to do. Thank you. You have a great day, sweetie. Mrs. Santana, the members of the community are calling you a hero. Anything, do you have anything to say? Cody, just want to let you know that we found the two men that was responsible for your brother's death, Trevor and Wally. Sorry for your loss. Thank you, Detective. See, baby, justice was served today.